guys so my kitchen is literally a hot mess do you see this yeah so let's go ahead and clean it all up guys so right here i'm washing out my red done jars because i only use them for decoration but i'm going to start giving them a purpose because we do have limited cabinet space so i have tons of red done that i just put on the shelf and make look pretty why not just go ahead and put the flour in the flour and the sugar in the sugar so that's what basically i am doing right now homemade chicken pot pie my first time ever making and i don't know the measurements it was just a dump and go but it came out perfect
smells good already i do have it on high because i'm going to put it in the oven once it's done in the crock pot so i'm gonna leave it for a couple of hours now that dinner is cooking let's get back to cleaning guys as you can see our laundry air is in the same room as our kitchen and it's the most annoying thing ever but we're making the best of it these containers are really really affordable i love them um, i buy a lot of things in bulk so it's easy for me to store things in these containers like cereal or cookies or whatever the case may be so yeah because I see my friend do that but I'm not gonna do that um if you don't know I'm an in-home daycare provider and I'm just gonna cook breakfast style for the kids for lunch so I got my hash browns already going and I did I'm using my radon pan um because I don't have a circular one and I am going to um butter it up which is the crust is already in the kind of crust the crust that I'm using is the crust pie crust and this is it and it comes in it has the two so with this one you just kind of unroll it and fill it and bake it so it's not like some people make homemade i didn't want to do all that because i didn't have time for all that so and i didn't want to do anything with the hassle so i have my butter i'm letting it melt and i'm gonna butter it up dump all of the chicken pot pie inside I'll put my crust on the top, butter that a little bit, and then toss it in the oven. Preheating my oven um, 375 degrees, and I'm gonna put this in the oven once they're finished preheating. Let it cook for maybe about an hour or two. So I finally got everything in the pan. Of course, my um, my um, crust is at the bottom, and I'm gonna go ahead and lay my crust. So I already put the crust on. I wish I kind of was. I'm using a, a circle pan because it would be so much better because the crust was actually circular, but I had to make it, you know, but it's okay. I'm just going to use this right on the pan and I'm going to set my oven to 350 and let it preheat. The, the chicken pot pie is almost literally gone and it came out super amazing, but I just wanted to show you guys the finished look, even though it's halfway gone. that's it i hope you guys like this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit the bell alert so you will never miss a video well i'll see you guys in the next one bye